It was an event congressional Republicans never imagined in their wildest dreams. <laughs> Gathering to greet their nominee for president, Donald Trump. And they all could not sound more eager to get beyond the discord. The headline is positive first step toward unifying our party. I do believe uh, that, that we are now planting the seeds to get ourselves unified. In fact, Trump and House Speaker Paul Ryan even issued a carefully crafted joint statement wow. using a version so of the word unite three times in Maybe one I'll paragraph, words, including, really we will be having additional discussions, but remain confident there's a great opportunity to unify our party and win this fall. But also said, while we were honest about our few differences, we recognize that there are also many important areas of common ground. The differences ran deep during the primaries. A total and complete shutdown. Ryan recoiling at Trump's tone and tenor, especially Trump's call to temporarily ban Muslims last December. This is not conservatism. CNN is told that today, behind closed doors, Ryan made clear to the billionaire it would be up to Trump to unite the GOP. A source familiar with the meeting says Ryan told Trump that while millions voted for him, many Republicans oppose him too. I represent a wing of the conservative party, you could say. Uh, he brings, he's bringing a whole new wing to it. He's bringing new voters that we've never had for, for decades. That's a positive thing. Still, Ryan was not yet ready to endorse Trump. This is a first very encouraging meeting, but again, in 45 minutes, you don't litigate all of the processes and all the issues and the principles that we, um, that we are talking about. A source familiar with the meeting also said Ryan brought up something near and dear to his heart, balancing the budget by reforming Medicare and Social Security, which Trump has argued he doesn't want to touch. And sources tell CNN that during the meeting, Trump mostly listened and said all the right things. The most anticipated meeting of the day was the first. Just these three men, Trump, Ryan, and Republican Party Chair Reince Priebus. CNN is told Priebus has been working hard behind the scenes for over a week to bridge the divide between the two. It's important to be unified. It's important to remember that... You know, but it's not usually this hard. Well, you know what? This was not an, a, an, a usual election. I mean, it was a very contentious, tough primary, and obviously no one can deny that. It was something that a lot of us haven't been through. Do you feel like a couples therapist? <laughs> no, you know what? You wouldn't say that if you're in the room. It was very, it was, it was great, and I think that the, it had very good chemistry between the two of them.